the Legos and Pokemon and the Beast. Okay, so that's three and that is five. So eight. Eight bucks. Mm -hmm. Games for it. I think I just sold them all. Oh. <laughs> Alright, so at that last sale you saw, uh, picked up the PS2, came with a couple memory cards, and I think that's a wireless controller. No cords for the PS2, but I got some extra ones laying around so I can test it out and clean it up. Uh, never know, it could be an empty disc in there, or it could be a disc in there. Uh, so we just gotta plug it up and find out for sure. Um, yeah, so some of y'all, these Pokemon cards. Uh, probably make another video going over going through the bag and just see what all we have inside and then we got the big old Lego set and the funny thing about it the woman before me sitting there talking to him was asking about the figures inside if it had all the figures and he said he didn't think it did and it turns out it don't it only has a couple of the figures inside of it but it looks like it's got all the pieces for the big ship there um, so still he he told her ten dollars for the Lego set and then I asked him how much for the PS2, the, uh, the Pokemon cards, and the Lego set, and he said $8. So I think her mouth dropped whenever he said that. So I ended up getting all three for $8. Uh, so it worked out for me. Uh, like I said, I'm going to probably do another video. Hello there, Mr. Bug. The one in my building. Anyways, uh, let's go over these Pokemon cards a little bit more here soon but it looks like there's some promising stuff in here like some older sets that you know I like to collect and it's mixed in with a lot of the newer sets so 
should be a fun video so we'll get that one up as soon as I can anyways that was a great sale so and that was the first sale of this week actually so great start to the week Good, how are you? You doing okay today? Yeah, not bad. How are you? Well, I'm doing okay, but it's a little warm. Yeah, it's real warm. <laughs> How much you got on your cameras over there? Uh, what do you think you're worth? I don't know. <laughs> I really don't. <laughs> Make me a deal on one and you got it. Alright. <laughs> Started out was gonna sell like for two or three dollars a piece, except this one right here, and I can't remember what she said on that one. Yeah, it was the oldest one. 
on that in the box. I can watch you sit on it. Okay. I'm in my. All right. So with that sale, we got all four of these cameras. Uh, we got all the Polaroids because they seem to have the most collectability. I get the most money out of them, especially if they're untested. They still sell. Um, I think that one's probably worth the most. It's a Sonar One Step Polaroid. It's, I've seen plenty of them online for two, three hundred dollars. Uh, of course, I'll be selling mine as untested. Uh, I have no way of testing these, but some decent Polaroids here, uh, especially this one. It's a cool cam. I think it was listed at a hundred dollars. Most of these were listed over a hundred dollars. Um, that one you usually buy for about twenty, about thirty bucks. But these three right here. I got some value to them. Um, of course, I want to be selling them as untested, and I'll probably throw them up on eBay auction just to see what I can get them. I might even lot them together. But anyways, for a buck a piece, I think I'll do well on this one.